Hello everyone, NG Phil here. I would like to give a huge shout out to Airsoft Torture Tests for the reviews on some of my designs. And I really appreciate that, man. That that will give me some crowdsourcing. Maybe a few people will like the videos. And go ahead and check out my user on Algadoo. So what we've got here is a few updates to my FAL. As you can see, the FAL now has a recoil mechanic, which I thought maybe some people might like. I put this on a lot of the larger caliber rifles and pistols that I make. Well, I haven't added it to any pistols yet. I will in the future. And what it does, it gives it a little sense of realism. I've also made the flash more reliable, it improved the ejection pattern just a little bit, and the ejection reliability. The rounds now extract almost every time. There's very few fails, fail, failed extractions. I haven't run into any recently, after these updates. And a few other things that I've improved is, as you may have seen on Bryce's video, I comment saying that the uh, bolt lock was purely unintentional. I changed that. Now it will lock intentionally. That was actually just a fluke before. It was the bolt face catching and snagging the back of the magazine follower. Now I've added a tab that does that more efficiently. So if you want to take a look at some of the internals, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select the skin, hold shift, scroll forward. There you go. And what I'm going to do is pull the trigger for you. You can see the mechanisms operating. There you go. Another thing that I've added is when you eject the magazine, the follower no longer bounces out of the top of it. It's just something that's a little nitpick of mine. Some of my guns still have it. I try to get rid of it as much as possible, but some designs I just can't because I run out of collision layers. You only have 10 collision layers in this game. In fun, you only had 7, which I'm surprised people even made some of these guns with that. This one, I was very conservative about the collision layers, so I only used 7 total, despite it being as complex as it is. Um, I try to use as few collision layers as possible, so if people want to make modifications, which I'm fully okay with, people can modify my stuff as much as they want. Uh, I know that uh, Airsoft Torture Test does that. I've seen some of his scenes, and they're quite awesome. I like some of the customizations that he makes. And if you want to modify my stuff and you know how, go ahead and do it. As long as you kind of give a pointer that it's my stuff, because that's just a courtesy. I don't expect it. I, w I request it, but I don't expect it. So if you don't uh, give me a, give people a pointer that's my stuff, it's fine. I'm pretty sure they'll figure it out anyways. But there you go. There's some of the updates I added. This is the update that I've uploaded. So if you have any questions, let me know. Go ahead, download it if you want. I'll provide a download link in the description to these to the site to the page that has this for download. Um. Again, if you have any questions, let me know, and thanks for watching. This is NG Phil. Have a good day.